Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with the first episode of Fallout 4. I've been very excited for this game. I went through all the time, you know, just doing the stream and uh, on my own time trying to learn a lot of the ways around to working a lot of the UI, and uh, I'm very excited for it. Mainly, I mainly did that just so I wouldn't look like an idiot, <laughs> but I will probably still look like an idiot, let's be honest here. Uh, went through the time to make the character look pretty much as close to my face as humanly possible. Uh, it's a little idealized, honestly, but, I mean, it's, it's my game, I can do it. I can do what I want with it. And anyway, everything else is pretty much spot on, altered her a little bit because, you know, I like redheads, shut up. Anyway, <laughs> let's get going. Confirm character. There we go. Alright, and uh, if you guys have heard, this will actually have my name, this character, because it didn't allow Stray Cat to be a spoken name. So, uh, it'll be mine, because that one is. Alright, let's, uh, let's turn off that radio, because we've already had problems with, you know, the b -b 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 stuff before with uh, copyright claims and whatnot. Uh, flag. Good old USA. Yep. Yep, that is for sure. We really need to get those vacation photos developed. Damn right we do. Uh, he always has good snippets to say about a lot of the stuff in the beginning path, and I just love it. I just love every bit of it. War never changes. <laughs> Got that right. <laughs> no need to get dressed twice. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Alrighty, let's get going along a little bit. And, uh, he... <clears throat> Whoa, my voice went weird <laughs> there for a moment. Uh, he used to actually be a, uh... In the War of 2077, he actually got done with his time in there. And, uh, that's why he's now, uh... You know, at home. A Braxo for all your cleaning needs. Yeah, he did all of his, uh, service previously, so now he's getting to, uh, relax at home... While the world starts going cuckoo bonkers crazy. There Another we go. Another fine product of General Atomics International. Always gotta love those. Yeah, let Codsworth take care of it. <laughs> eh, Codsworth. Oh, I can... Oh, that's a door. I thought I, there was something else I could activate in here that I never noticed before. Ah, good morning, sir. Hey, Codsworth. That is true. That definitely sounds good. Oh, right over there. Sounds good. Thanks, Codsworth. Thank you, Codsworth. Of course. Sugar bombs. Sugar bombs. 100% daily value of sugar. Yep. That's why we love it. Okay. Why do we have an ashtray in here? I'm pretty sure I don't smoke. At least I don't think I do. Grognak. Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. <laughs> oh, this guy is a man after my own heart. Thank you, Codsworth. You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. Yeah, I wouldn't have picked Sean as his name, but, you know. Cold front coming down from Canada. Well, how unusual is that? It's a little early to be drinking. <laughs> it's a little. It's a little. Uh, you're not exactly wrong. Mm. More of the same. Yep. Always. More of the same bullshit. I'll tell you back to Vader. Bunch of our old holotape recordings. Hey. Oh, man. This song is actually pretty good, but I don't want to listen to it. Strictly because it's I don't want to deal with that. that. Salesman. He comes for you every day. Does he now? I'm so proud of her. Yeah, this would be uh, our wife's a law diploma here. Uh, both of us have something to be proud of. Me, my military service, her, her law degree. Uh, let's talk to this guy. Good morning. vault -Tec calling. Uh, vault -Tec. vault -Tec? Remind me again? Yeah. Well, I hear about you, sir. And helping secure your future. Are you? Vault-Tec 
is the foremost builder of state-of-the-art underground fallout shelters. Vaults, if you will. Luxury accommodations where you can wait out the horrors of nuclear devastation. Oh, fun. I can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Urgency? Oh. No, all right, if you say so. I like your hat. Uh, I'm here now. I'm here now. So you are. So you are. Yeah, you're not wrong. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Well, thank you time for that. Time being a, uh, mm -hmm, a precious commodity. Yeah. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. 111. I would have said Vault 11D1. <laughs> That's because I'm a Lord of the Rings nerd. Uh, not as much as Stephen Colbert. Uh, is there enough space? But there's room for my entire family, right? Yeah. Of course. Of course. Minus your robot, naturally. Yeah, of course. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Is it? Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> unforeseen <total> atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. You say unforeseen. I don't think it means what you think it means. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you know what's exactly up. Uh, I'm pretty sure we all know what's exactly up. Uh, yeah, tell me more. Tell me more about this vault. Exactly. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Does it? To mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. Okay. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. Alrighty, if you say so, let's do it. Sure, let's do it. Splendid. Splendid. Yeah. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see. Alrighty. Now, let's do the name real quick. it be Thomas. There we go. Get that done right quick. Ha ha. Now, the stats. <laughs> That's going to be a thing. Um, I kind of want to put five here. Four there. Four. Uh, yeah, four here works fine. Uh, charisma. We'll do five there because, I, you know, I'm pretty good at that. I stumble over half my words, but, you know, I'm not great, but I'm not bad. You know, I'm pretty good. All right, intelligence. Uh, let's put that at an average four. Agility, <laughs> three. <laughs> let's put that at four. And my luck's kind of shit. If you guys have watched this uh, stuff at all. Your general good fortune and affects the recharge rate of critical hits. Oh, I didn't realize it would fuck it up that much. Well, I'll just, I'll, uh, just, I guess I'll just be sparingly with my critical hits when I use them. Yeah, my luck is kind of crap, though, let's be honest here. Um, yeah, I think that's as good and as good as that's going to get for me. Uh, yeah, okay. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just going to walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, Thank you. Thanks again. Thanks again, man. It's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you yeah, and Sean, so. no price is too high. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. That is true. I definitely do. Oh, Sean. Mr. Buddy. Thomas. Huh? has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. All right, Codsworth. You heard Codsworth. Go on. Okay, if you say so. Whoa, Codsworth, you in the way. If I may, Sean requires your personal attention. I'm... The boy needs his father, after all. You're, you're not exactly wrong, man, but come on, get out of my way. Oh, the future is here, and it is bright. Uh, I'm sorry at the gasp earlier, because I was like, oh my god, yes. Sean, buddy. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Oh, he's doing pretty good. 
He loves that. Oh yeah, I was. I'm happy I got that in there. Look at all that. Those nice little r rockets there. Much better now, huh? The Repcon Listen, rockets. After breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Oh. Weather should hold up. <laughs> Watch TV instead. <laughs> Uh, sounds fun. Yeah, sounds like fun. Yeah, let's do it. Mom, you should come and see this. Codsworth, what's wrong? What? What? Oh, the door closed. Why'd you close the door behind you, girl? This is our house. Followed by yes. Uh, followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds fuck. of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. Oh, jeez. We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my God. We okay. We need to get, get to the vault. vault now. Come on. Let's go. let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's run. Sanctuary Hills. Oh, okay. All right, let's head on. All right, whoa, look at those houses. All registered vault participants this way, okay. Okay, apparently their bag's screwed up. Okay. Already. Apparently, uh, he's dealing with some crap over there. If you're in the program, step forward. Otherwise, return home. That would be me. That would be me. We Officer. need to get in. We're on the list. Yeah, we're on the list. Let me in. Adult male. Yeah. Adult female. Yep. Okay, go ahead. All right. Thank you. No. Oh, that you two, follow me. Come on. Nazi. What's gonna happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Okay. Let's get going. Come on, Nora. Let's get to the vault as soon as we can. Come on. Step on the platform in the center. Platform in the center. Gotcha. There we go. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you, both of you. We love you too. Oh! Oh, my God. oh shit! Hold on! Oh fuck! Shut up, Whitfield! Jeez! Woo! Woo, boy! That was really fucking close. Oh Jesus! Sorry if the uh, recording got a little choppy there. Uh, I noticed it out of the corner of my eye. It got a little weird on the playback. We made it. We're okay. Okay, we're here. Everyone we're all good. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home, Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just yes, yeah. up the stairs. Just up the stairs. I believe it. If we left a minute later. <gasps> no, we'd no. all be. Don't get caught hey. thinking about that. You're that voice now. is familiar. Everyone He's in Skyrim. Well the voice actor anyway. Come on, Nora. Let's go. Hey there. Hey. Up the stairs. Alright. See you, sir. Alright, let's head up. We'll get Nora, stay with me. Okay. Head up the stairs. Female. Welcome. Ooh. That's nice. Hey there. Hey. Hello there. Once we seal the vault, we'll all be getting to know each other a lot more, I'm sure. If you say so. That sounded really kind of creepy, though. That sounded more creepy. Okay. Alright. Mrs. Abel, waiting for, uh... The husband, I assume. There we go. Whoa. Ow! That's screening me to make sure I don't have any issues. Okay. Or anything else, really. 
All right, say so. Each of you take one of these. Your brand new vault suits. Brand new vault suits, huh? It's down uh, the hallway right thanks. there. Thanks. What now? Yeah. Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where. Oh, the doctor will show me. Okay. All right, you three. Follow me. All right, if you say so. Hold it. This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna yeah. love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Is it? Not that the others aren't great, mind you. If you say so, I'm gonna hold you to that. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. Oh man. Father down in DC. Oh God, honey. What if they didn't make it? DC, yeah, uh, I doubt it. Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. All right, if you say so. Medical items. The hell are these? The hell are these, dude? There was none of this in the pamphlet. Well, we weren't even given a pamphlet. And put your vault suit on. Okay. Oh, Sean. Sean, buddy. Daddy's right here. Yeah, Daddy's right here. Who's my little guy? Yeah. I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. Yeah, he did. He does not look too real. Daddy, this is like. <laughs> Daddy's not going far. Yeah. All set. Just step yeah, let's go. And put on your vault suit. Yeah, he does not look too real in there. Okay, let's. Yeah, there we go. Man, I look good. All right, let's uh, pop me in here. There we go. Yeah, the kid <laughs> did not look very real in her arms. Depressurize you before we head deeper in the Depressurize. Relax. <sighs> okay. Time for a whole new life. Yep, let's go. Secure. Occupant vitals. Hey honey. Normal. Procedure complete. Procedure. In five. Whoa. Four, three. Two. One. Okay. This is weird. Yeah, the, the kid kind of looked like uh, the baby from the American Sniper movie. <laughs> oh, jeez. Just so fake. Uh, threw me off. <sighs> Cryogenic stasis. Is that what I'm in? Who the hell are you? Open it. Why are you opening the pod with my wife? Why do you have a gun? Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Nora! <laughs> Everything better be fine. Don't you point that fucking gun at my wife. Don't you. You motherfucker. Wait a minute, backup. The hell do you mean backup? Why the... What the... What the... Okay. <laughs> Come on, open this goddamn pod door. Open it. Come on. Uh, oh, jeez. Ow. Okay. I haven't got my land legs yet. Come on. Come on. There has to be a release. Release. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, God! Come on, open up. I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. Fuck. God. Damn it. Sorry, Nora. Sorry I couldn't help you. Shut this.
Maybe I could open. What? What is? Oh God! Why would Voltaire do this? Good question. We don't know. This... So the only ones that opened were mine and Nora's. I couldn't. I can't even close mine. Excuse me. Okay. Well, shit. Shit. Fuck. Damn it. Can't be the only one left. Apparently, I am. Oh. Anyone? God. Okay. Apparently, I am. They're dead. They're all dead. Every single one of them. They're they're dead. This one. Why? This one's empty. Why'd they do this? This one's empty. And I still can't open it. Well, fuck me. Uh, Vault 111 <laughs> monitoring terminal. Cryogenic array. Offline premature termination resulting in system failure. Isolated manual and remote overrides detected. Controls disabled. Okay. Life support. Uh, premature termination resulting in system failure. So it fucked life support too. Right. Pod C1 was empty. That would be the one behind us. Uh, unknown. Pod door manual override engaged. And mine would obviously be unknown. Remote override. Wait, remote override. Theirs was manual override. Why was mine remote override? Deceased, cause of death, asphyxiation due to life support failure. I assume that's the same for all of them. Okay. Alright, well. It's one hell of a way to start it off. Let's, uh, let's end the episode here for right now, and I'll see you in the next one. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. Share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games for you.